in an exhilarating round of 16 encounter at the FIFA Women's World Cup 2023, the Netherlands displayed unwavering conviction as they secured their place in the quarter-finals against Spain. However, the triumph was not without its challenges, as they had to endure several anxious moments before defeating a resilient South Africa side. The Netherlands started strongly, with Jill Ruard, Manchester City's record signing, nodding them ahead early in the game. Despite their lead, South Africa, led by the dynamic Thembai Ketlana, came close to equalizing multiple times, forcing exceptional saves from Dutch goalkeeper Daphne van Domseler. Lineth Bierenstein capitalized on a mistake by South Africa's keeper Kalen Swart, doubling the lead in the second half and sealing a hard-fought victory. However, the joy of the Netherlands' victory was tempered by the suspension of experienced midfielder Danielle van de Donk, who received her second yellow card of the tournament. Van de Denk's absence will be felt, but Netherlands manager Andries Jonker expressed confidence in the team's other talented midfielders and their ability to adapt. The Netherlands' journey in the Women's World Cup has been impressive so far, and they approach their quarter-final clash with Spain with determination and confidence. Jonker's side has proven they can score quickly, finding the net six times within the opening 20 minutes in various matches. Their attacking prowess and outstanding goalkeeping by Van Domseler have been key factors in their success. Facing the prospect of back-to-back -back finals, the Netherlands' ambition and strong form bode well for their upcoming challenges. They are eager to go one step further than their previous World Cup, where they narrowly lost to the United States in the final. While South Africa's World Cup journey comes to an end, they leave a lasting impression with their exciting, fast-paced attacking style that has entertained fans throughout the tournament. Despite challenges, including an ongoing dispute with their national association, Banyana Banyana's players have displayed passion and talent on and off the pitch. Manager Desiree Ellis commended her team's resilience and expressed hope for greater support and recognition of women's football in South Africa from sponsors and the government. The team's performance has earned them admiration, and Ellis believes their achievements deserve acknowledgement from the corporate world. With the Netherlands progressing to the quarter-finals in South Africa leaving the tournament with pride and newfound respect, the FIFA Women's World Cup continues to showcase the talents and determination of women's football on the global stage. Both teams have left an indelible mark and fans eagerly anticipate further captivating encounters as the tournament progresses. Don't miss the exciting highlights from this intense match. Subscribe and keep watching for more exciting games and surprises.